Hi, I'm Amy from Amy Tom Art and Design. Some of you guys may know me for my colorful oil paintings of anthropomorphic animal art, but I also illustrate in black and white with ink on paper as well. Today I'm going to talk about how I make my sewing patches, alternative ways to style them, besides sewing them on a jacket like I did right here, and a sneak peek of my holiday designs. So all my sewing patches are designed from my original ink drawings, like this original ink drawing that I have on display right here. And they are screen printed on 100% cotton heavy duty canvas with 100% water-based inks. They are machine washable, but I do recommend that you uh, put it in a laundry bag and turn it inside out. So this way with each time you wash it, it will last a lot longer an image that will last a lot longer and I do recommend that you sew it on either a tote bag or a jacket just something that you don't need to launder um, daily like a pair of, of jeans and on display right here on this demo I sold uh, one of my patches on a tote bag I use an embroidery floss right here and a feather stitch, but you don't need to use such a decorative stitch or embroidery floss. You can use um, the same kind of co uh, polyester or cotton thread I use to sew on buttons or repair clothes. That will work just as well. And a more simple stitch as a whip stitch or a, feather, uh, or a running stitch will work as well. And if you don't like to sew or don't know how, all my patches are uh, designed to, to fit standard size frames and mats. So this one right here is a four by four by four inch patch with a four by four inch mat in an eight by eight frame. And this one right here is a four by six patch framed in a five by seven inch frame of a four by six inch um, mat. So my favorite themes to paint and draw are anthropomorphic animal art, especially cats because they're my favorite animals. And my art often has a narrative to them and they're very character based. So for example, right here, I have a steampunk cat. And here is a bat cat. I also like to create lots of animal hybrids. And this design right here, is one of my newest designs for 2020 and also one of my favorites is a sphinx cat judge i wanted it to be really explicitly judge like so i designed a sphinx cat wearing a barrister's wig similar to the, um, the wigs you see judges wear in commonwealth countries and it even has a little caption that said only cats can judge i think lots of um, cat humans might get this reference and here is a kitty on a moon patch and a cat hunter patch. Um, some of cat humans who have indoor outdoor cats or have friends who have indoor outdoor cats we know what I'm talking about. So here is a sneak peek of some of the goodies I have planned for holidays 2020. This is my newest painting. It is cats and apparatus ski and it's my holiday design and it shows cats enjoying coffee and donuts after a day of tubing snowboarding and skiing and i plan to make uh, goodies such as stocking stuffers and greeting cards of it hi thank you so much for watching my video I had to film inside this time because it's getting a little too chilly to be filming outside my back patio. But hopefully you guys like what you see. And if you do, please visit my website www.amytomartdesign.etsy.com Hopefully I, I get to see you guys in a live event soon. Thank you. Have a good day.